Hey, this is Nate Mill. In this video, I'll show you how to get insane quadrant scores with your HTC Thunderbolt. This video is just for fun. shouldn't be taken too seriously. But uh, this score right here, 3,305. I'll show you how to get something kind of close to that. Okay, so the things you'll need for this video is Dasbanth, Imos Seon kernel, or any overclock kernel, I guess, and the Quadrant Standard app. So the first step is to reboot your phone. Okay, once your phone's rebooted, we're going to launch the DASBAMP toolkit. We're going to overclock our CPU here. This is pretty dangerous, so, you know, proceed with caution. We're going to set the max frequency to 1.92 gigahertz or whatever your highest frequency is the min frequency to 1.92 gigahertz as well so the CPU will only run at 1.92 gigahertz and the governor I have it on demand okay then we're gonna apply that and go back in there just to make sure it says current over here it shows you what you're running then I'm gonna go down to application settings and then here is uber quadrant it boosts your quadrant scores kinda cheating but as I said, this video is just for fun. Okay, and it should say it's enabled. And we're going to go over to Quadrant. Run full benchmark. Okay, first time we got 2,574. I'm going to hit back, run it again. The more times you run it, the better your score gets, usually. Okay, we got 2,978. So, that's pretty good. I'm going to run it again, one last time. Okay, we broke 3,000, 3,015, so that's very good. Now if you want, you can get an app like Shoot Me, okay, to take a screenshot of your phone. You can shake it. Okay, and I took a screenshot of that just for fun. Now, don't forget to put your CPU back to normal frequencies, alright? So, there you go. That's how to get crazy scores in Quadrant.